Take up the bottles of your anointing oil. Lift all the bottles up. Father, in the name of Jesus, the content of this bottle, or these bottles, is hereby declared the holy anointing oil. Yeah. And when David was anointed with oil, the Spirit of the Lord came upon him from that day forward. Now, this is declared a medium for the manifestation of the Spirit of the Lord. Yeah. Today, in particular, through the medium of this oil, be endued afresh with the spirit of obedience. Power to subscribe to every commandment of the Lord is released upon your life through the mission of this oil. Furthermore, Yet a little while, and the indignation shall cease. Isaiah 10, 25. And my anger will rise to their destruction. For it shall come to pass in that day that the burden of the wicked shall be taken from your shoulder and the soul from your neck, and you shall be destroyed because of the anointing. of this anointing oil, God's anger will be steered against your adversary. Every oppression of the devil around your life shall be brought to naught. Whatever you desire to drop, call it by name. Whatever must drop off your life, off your Affairs, call it by name. Whatever represents the finger of the wicked, afflicting, tormenting, and buffeting you, call it by name. This is the day the Lord has made. Something is breaking for you. Are starting this year in true liberty and freedom. The battle is over. 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 Take a little of this oil in your fingertips. And all that believe in the prophetic declarations of this moment, all that believe that by the touch of this oil you are in deal with the spirit of obedience, so you will enjoy obeying God. Obeying God will become a delight. Prompt obedience will become your lifestyle. All this obedience will become your delight. You believe that, and you believe that every yoke shall be destroyed today without exemption. You believe that by the touch of this oil, the mark of come not near is upon your life. Place that on your forehead and begin to make your declarations. Begin to make your declarations. It is what you say that you will have. Begin to make your declarations. You shall have whatsoever you say. The burden on my shoulder, the yoke on my neck, they are destroyed finally today. Yes, I'm singing a new song. I'm endued today with the spirit of obedience, making obedience a delight for me. The remaining days of my life, come on now. Begin to make your declarations. Whatever you declare is what God will confirm. What you don't declare, God cannot confirm. What you don't declare, God cannot confirm. What you don't declare, God cannot confirm. New chapters are opening to me every month of this year. New chapters in my spiritual life, in my ministry, in my business, in my career. New chapters in my heart. New chapters. Come on, I begin to declare that. In Jesus' precious name, we have prayed. This oil on your forehead is now a seal of exemption for you. All through this season of uncertainties, you shall be gloriously exempted. All through this season of meltdown, you shall be gloriously exempted. All 
through this season of famine, you shall be gloriously exempted. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. You are now endued with the spirit of obedience. From now, begin to command noiseless breakthroughs. Your obedience to his commandment will distinguish you every step of your life. In the name of Jesus. Every yoke of the wicked on your life is hereby destroyed. In Jesus' name. Now Jesus sent his disciples and they went forth healing everywhere. You will never live your life in sickness again. If there's anyone here that's challenging any part of his body, put your hand on it. And I'm going to pray this simple prayer. And the anointing on your head will flow down there and we set you free forever. How many believe he is going free this morning? How many believe that this new year is starting you in a new way? How many believe in his new order of health this morning? Come on, do that, what I said for you to do right now. In the name of Jesus, every part of your body that's been afflicted, as you place your hand on it right now, I command your instant healing and deliverance. Be healed in the name of Jesus. Your eyesight is healed. Partial deafness and total deafness is over. That terminal disease of cancer, of kidney failure, of liver crisis, whatever it is that is called incurable, is declared cured this morning. HIV is gone from your body. Cancer is gone from your system. Every growth, including goita, drops off you right now. In the name of Jesus Christ, that heart palpitation ceases now. That back pain ceases now. That spinal challenge is over now. Now, get out of your wheelchair. Get out of that wheelchair. Throw away those crutches. The night this morning is declared your money of liberty. Yeah. Weeping has started for a night. Joy has come this morning. Yeah. In the name of Jesus Christ. That migraine is caused right now. Yeah. That crisis in your neck is over right now. Yeah. That stiff neck is loose right now. Yeah. Fibro drops from your body right now. Yeah. Infertility is over your life today. Yeah. In the name of Jesus Christ. Every form of hormonal imbalance is over in your life today. I decree your total liberty right now. That waist pain is gone forever. That deafness is over today. That blindness is over today. In the name of Jesus. Receive your sight in the name of Jesus. Receive your sight in the name of Jesus. That stammery is over today. That stammery is over this morning. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your name. In Jesus' precious name.